when I say effective communication, what comes to you? To me, when I say effective communication, there is one thing that comes to my mind. It's a people's aspect. What is this people's aspect? You can be a mother, a daughter, a teacher, a trainer, a college student, or a person in the highest authorities or in the leadership positions. That one aspect which pulls people or pushes people away is nothing but effective communication. For a communication to be effective, there are two aspects. One is language aspect. A language aspect is nothing but the language calibration. What is said, how you tell it correctly. But the second aspect is the people's aspect. How you say it, that's the most important. Without language aspect, people's aspect plays no big role. Because if there are many mistakes, if the language is bad, and then you're trying to communicate something, you do not make the desired effect on the other people, the listeners, the audience. And what happens if you're not creating that impact on that people's aspect? You have good language, but no people's aspect. What happens? Your listeners are not interested. So a language, a communication, an effective communication is a combination of the people's aspect and the language aspect. If I'm going to stand plain like this and speak, this is nothing but blah, 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 blah. No actions, no gestures, no voice modulation, no proper language calibration. What happens? Definitely people will lose interest. Or if I'm going to talk with a language that requires a lot of calibration. Again, people will not be pulled to the content that I'm trying to deliver, but rather people will be attracted to the mistakes that I make in my language. And it's natural. You cannot blame people for that. And if we are going to blame, how many people are we going to blame? We ourselves get attracted to the mistakes that others make. And there is a logical explanation to that as well. So, how to give or how to be an effective communicator? There are seven C, C involved in this technique. Seven C's. Correctness. I'm going to say only that. Correctness. That's it. I'm not going to add anything else more. There are six other C's. After I started coaching in uh, fearless and fluent English, I personally had a lot of messages with, from many people asking for personal coaching. I will not be able to coach so many people personally, but rather I have started a group coaching model, Speak Like a Pro, a 30 days challenge in which you can assuredly become a, an effective communicator from the language aspect and the communication, people's aspect. You have to pay two triple nine for this. We are going in for a group coaching model under which we will be having a separate Facebook community. You get to practice, you get to uh, talk to other people. I will be personally posting certain videos in that group for your extra knowledge. Other than that, I will be appearing live two times in a week, especially for you. One educational session, a two hours educational session, and one doubt clarification session exclusively for the all of you who wanted to start a session with me. This is not only for women, though this is a part of Wonder Woman society, I realized men are in need of it too. I had a lot of messages from gentlemen as well. So this is not just for women, but this is for men too. Both of you can register now. The program is starting in another week. So why miss this opportunity? Grab the opportunity now and start becoming a speaker and speak like a pro. And also wait for many more videos to come on the seven C's. Until next time, thank you so much.